Sean Connery has gone native in this yes. movie. He's gone entirely Japanese. He's, had, he's oh, you gone must excuse in- this rather odd mixture of styles, but I refuse <laughs> to go entirely Japanese. Sean Connery does not refuse to go entirely Japanese. My <laughs> man is a complete <laughs> fucking weeaboo. He knows everything. He takes his shoes off. You, the, <gasps> and the way that you are introduced to that concept, yeah, is that Wesley Snipes, whose name is Webb, Webb. And Connery's name is Connor. Like th- are these guys, just not capable of acting if their name no. isn't similar or whatever. No. But like, he arrives at this fucking place in Little Tokyo. <sighs> Sean Connery <gasps> is fucking kneeling on a tatami, and he asks him <laughs> to take his shoes off. He's doing calligraphy. Like, oh fuck! Oh yeah. fuck! <laughs> it's so weird. <laughs> But he's a weeb because to a modern audience this just reads like he's a weeb which is a modern not audience. at all how it was intended no. to a modern audience this just reads as <laughs> normal weeb Sean Connery played for like fucking yeah. terror marks because you're like god imagine if a white guy was Japanese yeah like, he's, he's got like a, a sort of a, a pointy beard like a fucking like fucking Mifune or whatever and it's it, I don't know so, but like to a modern audience, we'd been expecting him to have like a hentai bedspread, or like you, yeah. he, he would like have a kabuki noise as his doorbell. But like to to the, to the audience of 1993, it was just like being, <gasps> that's a lot of Yuri on ice, bitch. So he's, he's got a fucking uh, daikamura. Is the <laughs> you join me on the kachu? <laughs> so so. I got to show mash. So, uh, Webb picks up John Connor, and in the car, on the way over to, to the Keiretsu's office, Sean Connery explains Japan. <laughs> and it's, this was the sequence that made me want to pick this movie. Mm-hmm. Uh, it, he he tells him, oh, keep, your, keep your, like, sh- your suit jacket buttoned all the time. Um, and do keep your hands at your sides. The Japanese find big arm movements threatening. Yeah, so that's something else that we should note here, is that this guy is, like, the Japan expert. That's yeah, his fucking the Japan name. Guy. Mm-hmm. That's his typecast. And yeah. he's just... He's racist towards the Japanese. Yes. It's worth noting that just at the offset. This guy is supposed to be an expert, but he's very like, they'll be scared if you raise your arms. They're very flighty people. He's like Lazenby and the man from Hong Kong. He has learned a lot about Japanese culture in order to be racist towards it more effectively. <laughs> it's it's incredible. Also, he insists, and this is going to be a recurring point, but he insists on re- referring to Wesley Snipes as... Kohai. In As Japan, the, the Shempai Kohai relationship <laughs> is assumed just... <laughs> whenever a younger man so and an older man fucking are funny. together. He insists on being called Senpai. Senpai. He insists! <laughs> they call John Connery so Senpai multiple times and he's not wrong about the senpai kohai relationship but no it's but it is as extremely like... funny to hear sean connery mm. in sean connery voice say the senpai kohai relationship <laughs> i genuinely <laughs> so good. i oh, oh my god 